Hello world! We are so happy that you stopped by. My name is Mignon Farmani. Hello, my name is Shore Farmani. And we are here in Hollywood, California. We have yes, just fine. got home from the RLS, Richard Lawson Studio Open yes. Class. Really, really fun. Really, really cool. Totally excited. It yeah. was over on Lancership and Magnolia at a studio there, or maybe an art studio or a dance studio. Yeah. They rented the space and filled it up with chairs. But it wasn't, it wasn't enough. enough. It was so many actors there actors that I wanted just to learn. Piling about. in. Yes. Just. It was serious. And it was great. The energy was great. It was great to be around like minded people that are doing what you are doing. Open minded people too. Definitely. Yeah. So how did the class start? We started off by dancing. Awesome. Wow. I've yeah. never encountered that ever in my Me life. Me either. That's I mean, so fun. usually you're in a class you and do a little something. You kind of shake it off. Yeah. But I get it, get it, but no, Yeah. I'm unique New York. Yeah. You know, you need <laughs> unique you New know, York. I can't even say it, but this class was so on. They started with some Michael Jackson, PYT, and. You know I think I'm a pretty young man. Yes, you so, do, Mom. I was loving that song, and the energy was crazy. It was just exhilarating. Yeah. I was just like, oh, my God, I am loving this. And then the music went off, and it was time to sit down. And I'm like, how do you sit down? <laughs> I can't sit down. I was just dancing, and yeah. I was doing the WAP and oh all that gosh. kind of stuff. It was so but funny. It was so great. So after that they put up a scene and um some actors came up they did their scene it was great it was from tootsie and um yeah. totally enjoyed it i it mean was really good i was in my head sometimes as an actor like oh he did this he did that but it was really awesome it was really good well, yeah. well and the done. bravery right to be an actor and be on stage i mean that's what i live for every day so yeah. it, i don't have a problem with that especially but, in theater right yeah it's right on the spot as That's in why camera, I we can do it over and over theater. again. I mean, I, I don't care what anybody too, says about theater. You know, they say so much stuff. I feel sometimes, but I love yeah, it. sometimes in LA, it, it almost seems like it's not respected, but it's important, and it really shows that you're a really great actor. Yeah, it's just two different worlds. Yeah, film and theater, and you and should know how to do both, in my opinion. Definitely, you should understand the difference between yeah. them. But um, then they went on after that scene. He he critiqued the scene, or I shouldn't use that word because mm -hmm. he does not like that word. Mm -hmm. He likes uh, he assess. assess. He likes to assess, just to give you his opinion on it, you know. But he says, "Well, my opinion should be a little bit of right, right?" Because I I got this whole background doing all this stuff, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. But he said he hated the word critique because it means you're being critical of yeah. someone. And for me, I love to hear that as an actor because I come from Aaron Spicer, and it's not a game at that school. Aaron Spicer is not for play. Yeah. He's straight up like, get the fuck out of here. I don't believe you. I don't even believe you. Just stop. You know, and he'll just stop you right in the middle, which is kind of what happens when you're on a set. I yeah. mean, I'm a working actor, and I can be on the set. I was just shooting a commercial recently that's current airing right now and the director just stopped me not the director but the person who owned the business and he yeah. was just like you know I, you know I, I don't believe you or you're overacting or you know and you're always looking for that happy medium place because you're trying to please the director you're trying to please the client and exactly. it's um, so many aspects of acting and you just want to make sure you get them all right but um, back to the class we totally enjoyed it and he talked a lot about things that he has coming up he's mm -hmm. building a new studio called Waco oh my gosh um, so awesome him and Miss Knows his new wife they're yes. going to be doing that project together sounds yes. amazing and before I even knew he was the husband of Beyonce's mom um I kind of got wind to him because he did a movie with my friend Ricky Harris, who's another actor, and I saw Ricky posted a picture with him. And from that moment, I kind of went on to his Facebook page and I just began to follow his acting studio and have always wanted to go to an open class. And just recently, I think it was yesterday, I found out he was married to her. But um, that just goes to say that before that, I was totally interested in this guy because he's a working actor. And um, I like to go study with people who know the business. They're in it. They understand. So he's got this new studio coming called Waco. And that stands for Where Art Can Occur. 
Love it. Love that. Love that. And they're going to be doing a nonprofit organization with his wife called Tina's Angels. Um, that's something that's going to be coming soon. So look out for that. But they have a lot of great things happening. But I think the most exciting thing I learned, um, they have many tiers of acting classes you could take. P1, P2, Cold you down with OPP, just all these P's, right? Yeah. There's a lot of P's. <laughs> it was, but they have a method to their program and to their madness. And as they explained it, I thought it was really, really great. Really great. And um, I think, um, what was that you said really stood out to you um, that he said? He kept on saying that... Um, Hollywood is your plan B. Yeah. That people get oh, yeah. that mixed up. You know, they're like, I'm going to Hollywood. That's what I'm doing. I'm going to make it. Yes. But you have to create it. Start, if you feel like this is what you want to do, start writing your own thing. You Definitely. know, start writing your own sitcoms or yeah. whatever, your own play. Do yeah. it and get it done now because Hollywood is waiting for you. Yeah. He yeah. really talked about plan A being you are the creator of your career and plan B. Uh, Hollywood will come along at some point, maybe, yeah. you know, because it's serious out here and it's thousands of actors who are wanting to do the same thing. So yes. you see me on my Instagram page, um, which is at I am Mignon for money. I'm posting all the time about my auditions and walking in them because just to get the audition is awesome. There's been probably like a thousand to 3000 yeah. submissions and then they choose you of 50 people to come in. Yeah. So it's really a celebration every time you get the audition. Definitely. Um, he also talked about having a children's class coming soon. That's going to be cool since I have a daughter who is a child actor too, a, an even younger one. Um, what else should we talk about? Should we mention? I think, oh, they, he, they all, everyone in the school, all the students, they kept on talking about their community. They were so close with one another. Yeah. They helped one another. They were like, when, when my friend books an audition, I booked it too. You know, yeah. we're one and. They help each other and they seem so amazing. You know, yeah. everybody needs that kind yeah. of friendship. And that's so great to have yeah. a community like that that's supportive because it's not a competition. Not. You're not competing with another actor. You are who you are and you are sharing yeah. your take on your perception on what you yeah. believe that character Which can is. Which be totally different from the person that's after you. Of course. So yeah. never think of acting as a competition. That's not what it's about. It's for you to be who you are and bring that. Yeah. Um, but that was great. And not only did he talk a lot about community, but everybody there is learning to film. They're learning to edit. They're making their own movies. They're learning to direct, Oh, produce. my God. And that they have, amazing. like, a lot of people who are in the class that aren't actors. So yeah. people who are just interested, um, casting directors, like Twinkie Bird. Uh, Twi I'm not sure if I'm saying her name right, but she is in that class. And some other um, working actors are in the classes there. And people who he said he had a nutritionist and people yeah. who are not actors, but they want to understand acting and get out of their shell so he talked about that and that was really cool too um overall i liked it it I was great it. it was great energy i loved walking in there um, i did have a few questions for the working actor which i didn't get to ask which was um for me as a working actor i'm auditioning almost every day can i work on my scenes there you know if we're if i'm in the scene study class yeah. there can i bring in my work and not have to pay $150 or yeah. $75 for a private. Um, I also wanted to know, like, they were creating a lot of films there. Are they getting IMBD credit for those films? Because yeah. that would be awesome. Because we heard are. they were, some of them, their films were getting dropped at Sundance Festival, yeah. the African American yeah. festivals, and... So it sounds like some big stuff going on. Yeah. So it's a great place. If you're interested in learning more about Richard Lawson Studios, you can look them up on, on Google him. Yeah. Um, he has his own website with information. He's also on Facebook and they have lots of classes. So you can also send them an email and request to audit a class. They're doing interviews right now. You can't just sign up and join the class. Yeah. They have to interview the you. Whole process. Make sure you ain't crazy. They're going to screen you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you okay yeah. and then you know they decide whether you're you're good enough or I, i'm not really sure what their procedure is because i haven't went through it so i don't want to speculate yeah. but i want to end this with something that he said at the end and he kept saying people were using the word doing 
And what does doing mean? And here was his answer doing. Declaration of Independence. And he talked about how the world is trying to abide by this Declaration of Independence that was created many years ago, this outline of what America should be. And he talked about us as actors needing yeah. a Declaration of, of Independence, independence yeah. for our career. Find for me, yes, for yeah. me, I have goals all around the house. I pride myself on writing out goals. I make my kids do it. It's important for me to see what I need to do. Write it out. Check it off one by one. Yeah. And they have a strategy for teaching you how to administrate your career, which I have never heard at any school. That is awesome. So Richard Lawson, we loved your studio. <laughs> we loved your open Thank class. You. We had a great time. We were sitting in the back. And then more seats came in in the front. So we hopped up. And <laughs> we, we got moved. a great, really yes. great seat. Oh yes, my and I'm so glad we did because the energy was great. So we are so grateful to you that you had this open class. And we got an opportunity to learn about your studio. And from the moment we walked in the door, the guys at the door, the lady at the door, the energy was through the roof. Awesome. It was great. It felt great. A great and, team behind um, you. I'm looking forward to coming and auditing the class and going further and seeing if, you know, this might be a place I want to hang out at. So I yeah. um, hope you learned something here. Please remember to follow us on Instagram. I am Mignon Farmani at I am Mignon Farmani. I am at Shore underscore Farmani. So keep up with us and we'll be sharing more reviews with you. Yeah. We just moved here four weeks ago and we are going to be auditing classes. We are going to be auditioning. Everything we're doing. It's booming. We're going to be oh sharing gosh, it with so you. Excited. Yeah. And what could be more exciting than watching us here in Hollywood? We are going to be <laughs> telling you what's up. What is up with the acting world. Yeah. So um, stay tuned. All right. Peace. <laughs>